to Celtic Park for this evening's SWPL action where Celtic host Glasgow City two of this season's title protagonists going head to head this first place City take on third place Celtic it is a must win match for the home side defeat tonight would rule them out of the title equation For City a win as well would guarantee European football next season. Place in the top two. Celtic make five changes from the team which needed a 95th minute winner to overcome Partick Thistle on Sunday. That sees Logan, Otto, Clark, Bowie and Mark Kinnerney all dropping out, replaced by Tahona, O'Riordan, Shen Meng Yu, Kerner and Shen Meng Lu. City recorded their third win in a row since that Scottish Cup defeat to Celtic the last time the two sides met. They make two changes from the side that won on Sunday. Bea Prades and Hayley Lauder replacing Kinga Kozak and Mary Fulton. It is expected to be a record breaker in the SWPL this evening with a bumper crowd expected at Celtic Park. Throw is cut out, Motalo might get on the end of that though. Linda Motalo, but a space opening up. Plays it wide for Chinchia. That's inside Chinchia, will feed Oscarson. It's a good ball for Davidson. Into the box, Lauren Davidson, it's cut out by O'Riordan. That's lovely work by Davidson to win the first corner of the match. Is Haley Lauder then over the ball for this corner and it goes deep. There's the header from Davidson and wide of the mark from Lauren Davidson. He's followed, that's cut out by Chinchia. And City might be able to launch a bit of a counter attack here. Chinchia will cut inside Priscilla Chinchia. And the first shot in anger of the match. Spins wide from Priscilla Chinchia. Lee Gibson taking command there. Davidson. Spins past one. Lauren Davidson has wheel and ahead of her. Davidson will go herself. And not too far away, Lauren Davidson. Clark, that's Davidson wide, tries to slip that through for Davidson and it's walked out as well, Davidson can come into the box here, Lauren Davidson and it's in from Lauren Davidson, well a mistake at the back there and Lauren Davidson has taken full advantage and in what could be a crucial match in the SWPL title race, it's Glasgow City that take the lead at Celtic Park. Lovely ball through from Jenna Clark, not dealt with by Chloe Craig. And Lauren Davidson only needs one chance. as well by Linda Modalo. Oscarson leaves it for Davidson. Modalo quickly under pressure from Jacinta, does really well to retain possession there. Wide for Lauda. Chinchia. Chinchia comes into the box, Priscilla Chinchia opens up the space. And a good save by Tahona.
just sent in out. Tries to turn. Looks for the run of Amy Gallagher. We'll get it back, Jacinta. Tries to get that across. There's Flint and Gallagher. They're not quite dealt with initially, and Amy Gallagher there. It's picked up in the midfield as well. Chance now for Natasha Flint. They try and step past Prades. Comes away with it. Flint! Celtic creating a little more now. Then for Ryldon. Just sent up wide. Shin Meng Lu. Cut out by Oscarson. Meng Lu will try again. And Clark will clear only as far as Shin Meng Yu. Hayes. Ryldon picked up by Craig. Just sent up. Tries to work over a space, just sent up. We'll get it back, Chloe Craig. Shin Ming Lu. Cuts back Ming Lu and delivers the cross. They're looking for Flint away by Muir. Lauder underneath it as well. Only as far as Shen Ming Yu. It's a decent effort from Shen Ming Yu. And the first shot on target for the home side. Gibson forwards flipped on by Oscarson. Wheel in there, will try and bust past. O'Riordan who defends well. And Clark now for City at the back. It's a good ball wide to Amy Muir, but a space for Chinchia ahead of her as well. Looks to feed it into that space. And Priscilla Chinchia might have a chance here. Chinchia Hayes comes across. Chinchia has a lovely block by Caitlin Hayes. Davidson into the box, Lauren Davidson. No support out wide though. And it was always going to be difficult to come away from the ball there. Lauren Davidson, but that's a slack pass to Amy Muir. We'll go for it herself, Amy Muir. And not far away either. Oh, what a chance that was for Chinchia. Shouts for the foul there from Lauder, but not going to be given. There is Gallagher. And no time left then at the end of the first half. That one Lauren Davidson goal, the difference between the two sides, but it has been quite the contest. It is an enthralling match, an enticing one, and it is set up beautifully for the second 45 minutes. Half time at Celtic Park, it's Celtic nil, Glasgow City one. It's enticing that, isn't it? To try and take on the, the shot might just be a bit far wide. It's gonna go played straight through the middle, punched clear by Gibson, only as far as Flint, it's a good save from Gibson, he's wide and what a chance that was for Celtic to pull level at the start of the second half first corner of the second half for the OE side will be Hayley Lauder to deliver and the ball goes the header it's on target it's saved by Tahona forward for Kerner the drive towards the byline Kerner plays it low across for Gallagher takes it down, out to the edge for Natasha Flint and Natasha Flint again is the Thornton City side a tremendous strike from the edge of the area just too much for Lee Gibson And Celtic pool level. Muir yeah. and field cleared away by Shen Meng Yu and Jacinta will give chase here. She might get on the end of it as well. This could be a great chance and a great save by Gibson. 
Oh, what a chance that was for Celtic to pull in front just moments after equalising. But Gibson there, the hero for City. Just into infield. Flint urged to shoot, will go for it, Flint. Built by Gibson. And Chinchia there to see it away and Kerner will concede the goal kick. Ball across. There's the header. And there's the goal. It's Claire O'Riordan. And Celtic have turned things round. A perfect ball in for Claire O'Riordan. Nothing the goalkeeper could do about that one. Taken in well by Whelan. Forwards by Oscarson, cut out by Natasha Flint. We'll see it back to the goalie. Has to deal with it, the keeper, as well. And that's maybe not the best option she had, but Celtic have worked it clear at least. Davidson under pressure from Kelly Clark quickly and cleared away. Oscarson with the header forward, taken in by McEnany, who clears and might be a chance to run at this. Lefersky as well. Has two for company, but Ketlaferski's in here, and Ketlaferski may well have sealed the three points for Celtic this evening. A quick counter-attacking goal up from Celtic, a lovely ball through from Maria McEnany. And Laferski slips the ball beyond Gibson. Looks like the referee ready to blow the full-time whistle as this free kick is taken, and that will be that for this evening. Celtic turning things round in the second half to take the three points and to set up one heck of a finish to the Scottish Women's Premier League season. City remain top of the table, but their lead is just two points over both Rangers and Celtic with two games to go.